Stephen Bear has been reported the RSPCA for leaving his distressed puppies alone all night just weeks after being accused of being responsible for the death of his dog Wolverine. The celebrity Big Brother winner is said to have been reported by an angry neighbor who shared an image of a note written to Stephen on Instagram, according to The Sun. It reads, your pups have been barking and crying since 6 a.m. Sunday. They sounded very distressed. Don't you realize dogs are not meant to be left on their own all night? It's a pity that you moved around here because you have spoiled a nice quiet area. Be a responsible dog owner. Go back to where you belong ignorant pig. The council and RSPCA have been informed. Okay. Online has contacted the RSPCA and a representative for Stephen Bear for comment. Stephen became the owner of two new puppies just days after the death of his dog Wolverine. Bear revealed he's named the dogs after infamous East End gangster twins Ronnie and Reggie Cray. It comes after Bear released an emotional video statement earlier this month following his dog's death. He told his fans of his devastation after his puppy Wolverine tragically died just days after the star had his name tattooed onto his neck. However, in the wake of Wolverine's sad death, Stephen was viciously slammed by a fan and blamed for the death of the dog. To put any speculation to rest, the former ex on the beach star explained exactly what happened, and said he wanted to put an end to the horrific negativity on social media. There's a rumor going round that I've killed my dog, he said on Instagram to his 1.3 million followers. I wasn't going to say anything. But I'm just going to put to bed what actually happened. He continued, My dog fell really ill. It couldn't eat its food and was fed from its paw from a glucose drip. When they took the drip out of its paw, it turns out the paw got infected when they bandaged it up. After they removed the needle it was too tight so it lost circulation and his paw was infected. I went to three different vets and it turned out his arm had to be amputated or get put down. So I paid over £2,000 to have his leg amputated, obviously to keep him because I love him. I love them. I don't put animals down. I'm not cruel to animals. It upsets me that people would think I'd do my dog any harm.